Hi guys, today I have the Pokemon Scale World Sinner Set 1 to unbox. I've also pre-ordered the rest of the Sinner figures that are going to be released. There are 9 figures in this set. Here's the lineup. Here's the size comparison to the other figures. There are six boxes in this set. Here's what the smaller boxes look like out of the box. The smaller figures are together and the larger ones are by themselves. First we have Turtwig. He's really small. Even with his small size, he's really well painted. He comes with a stand. Which starter did you pick for the Pokemon Diamond and Pearl remake? I picked Pickblock. I picked Turtwig for the original. Now we have Pipblop. He's also really tiny. His white spots seem a bit off-centered. But other than that, it's also well painted. And he has a stand. Now we have Pimplop, Pimplop. It's hard to say his name. Like the others, the figure is really well painted. He has a stand. Here we have Empoleon. You need to attach his tail. It sticks on better than the older Scale World figures. Empoleon is really nicely detailed. Our last starter is Chimcha. His tail is slightly translucent. He has a stand. Now for his evolution, which is Monferno. You need to attach his tail to his red bum. Here's a closer look at his red bum. This figure is well sculpted. And the paint is good as well. Like Chimcha, his tail is also slightly translucent. He comes with a stand. The final Pokemon is Infernape. He also needs his tail to be attached. He doesn't have a red bum though. The tail needs to be on the right angle to be attached. Instead of his tail being translucent, it's the flames on his head which is translucent. I really like his pose. He also comes with a stand. Even though he doesn't need one. Now for a closer look at Dawn. 
The Hitme characters aren't as well sculpted as the Pokemon. But it still looks good. Her head can rotate left and right. Here's a closer look at her bracelet. The bottom of her shoes are just white. I like the design of her bag. Her red scarf is below her hair, but you can't see it. She also comes with a stand. Last we have Lucas. He probably looks the worst out of the lot. The face sculpt makes him look like he's middle aged. His head can rotate. He wears a similar bracelet to Dawn with the two balls. <laughs> The bottom of the shoe is also white. I like the Pokeball design on his backpack. He comes with a stand. I hope you enjoyed my unboxing of the Bandai Scale World Dinner Set 1. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Thanks for watching.